Diversity is about difference. Today's workforce comprises people of different ethnic backgrounds, genders, beliefs, ages, physical abilities and lifestyles. Organisations which embrace diversity understand that every one of their people is unique. Difference is not only acknowledged, it's also highly valued. Diversity takes the approach that people should be treated as individuals and it's about respecting the individual. It's about treating everyone fairly and treating everyone with equal levels of respect. That may not be treating everybody exactly the same. Legislation protects people against discrimination, harassment and victimisation. But successful organisations go far beyond simply complying with their legal obligations. They create inclusive environments where everyone feels valued and is encouraged to achieve their full potential. The thing that's in it for staff is that uh, they feel more connected with their organisation. It's as simple as that. They actually feel you've got an organisation here who will treat me on merit. Uh, that if I'm talented, I'll actually be able to progress. That if I have a contribution to make, it will be listened to. Uh, that um, if there's a team, um, I'm going to have a perspective which will be valued. Now, that then means that you will, you know, you, you, you feel you're making a contribution to an organisation and consequently means that you want to come to work. Everyone in the workplace has a responsibility for creating a climate in which people don't have to worry about whether or not they fit in. For example, because of their sexual orientation, their religion or their age. I think if people feel that they can be themselves, they're more comfortable. If they're more comfortable in the workplace, um, they're likely to perform better. They'll be more satisfied, more motivated, and that leads to better performance. So it's a, it's a, a virtuous circle.